How are you all feeling? Welcome to this global meditation call to codes. Thank you for being here. You incredible beings, wherever you are on this beautiful planet. Thank you for showing up and bringing your light, your frequency, your alchemical magic to this party. Let's just get everybody in. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Very important meditation, activation, bit of work that we've got to do. A beautiful co-creation that we're going to go through this evening. Just thank you for showing up. Spiritual gangsters. Welcome to the party. So I'm recording this from the start, guys. Even though we're doing this on Zoom, I'm going to put this up on uh, YouTube afterwards, probably later on this evening, so other people can go through this process tomorrow so we can just reinforce those templates and hold space for the next few days whilst we go through this process, through this solar eclipse. Let's get everybody in. We had 1,670 something people register. So it's beautiful to be here with so many souls. Not everybody's turned up yet, but that's okay. So before we get into this, let's just have a show of hands of where you guys are from. Let's see where everybody's dialing in from around the world. <clears throat> so we got Spain, Australia. We've got San Diego, Virginia, London, Australia, Poland, Scotland, Oregon, London, Macedonia, New Jersey, Surrey, UK, UK, Trinidad, Utah, Serbia, Poland, Netherlands, Las Vegas, Wales, Florida, Italy, France, Scotland, Washington State, Oregon, Los Angeles, Portugal, California, California, Ireland, USA, California, US, Sweden, Mauritius, Arizona, UK, Ireland, New York City, Canada, Washington, UK, Florida, Hawaii, Scotland, LA, Ireland, Maui, Idaho, Alabama, Chicago, Texas, France, Manhattan, New Jersey, Maryland, Ireland, London, Hawaii, Hawaii, Ohio, South Africa, Mexico, Paris, England, USA, Lebanon's in the place. New York, UK, Dorset, Seattle, Washington, Scotland, Sweden, Spain, Scotland, Romania, Abu Dhabi, London, Dubai, Serbia, Bucharest, Florida, Ireland, Switzerland, Wigan in the UK, Germany, Romania, Hungary, Magdalena, England, WA State, India, New Hampshire, London, Huddersfield, Oregon, Glastonbury. Sydney, Ireland, Las Vegas, San Jose, Boston, Florida, Belgium, Miami, Canada, Canada, Bristol, Florida, New York, Mexico, Miami, Canada, see if India's in the place, Let's see if I can find any other countries, London, baby, hello, Lester, how are you, brother, more from Romania, Canada, we've got Gibraltar in the house, Colorado, Pennsylvania, Isle of Wight, Slovenia, Norway, Greece, Montana. Where else have we got? Iceland's in the place. Estonia, Portugal, Netherlands, Serbia. <coughs> Where else have we got? Austria, Essex, Toronto, Arizona. Romania again, Germany. I'm just trying to flick through and find some countries that I've not mentioned. Um, more from Greece. Loads of people in the house. Geneva is in the house. Switzerland again. Malaysia is in the house. Hello, Malaysia. We got Belize. Hello, Louise. Tasmania is here. Amazing. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So cool. New Zealand, we've got New Zealand in the house. We've got the Canary Islands here. Amazing. All over the world, man. Dialing in more from Lebanon. Loads from the US, from the UK, Austria, Vienna, Quebec, South Wales. 
what else have we got here that's people from all over the world man it's so beautiful thank you for showing up everybody i love you guys so much got jorick in the house north carolina more from ice and we've got costa rica in the house amazing beautiful 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 okay guys so why are we here today it's the solar eclipse tomorrow, and it's uh, a solar eclipse that's kind of a bit unusual. That's not really taken place like this exactly since 2017. And it's interesting that if you look at the numerology between 2017 and now, it's like six years, six months, six weeks, and six days. That come, kind of 666 is weaved in through that numerology. Now, as this solar eclipse takes place tomorrow, the plan is when there's zero sunlight, they can activate certain portals, okay? Using that Hadron Collider in, in CERN, in, in Geneva, using certain multidimensional skill sets that they've got, you know, magic, which we all have a bit available to us too, but sometimes it can be used for darker purposes. They want to open up portals, one of them right in front of the sun, one behind the moon, and some other ones dotted around the galaxy. And the plan is to create massive distortions, suck up cosmic energy, and use it for their own purposes. So what we need to do is we need to create sun. We need to create photons. And so what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be going to the west coast of Argentina. to a very specific national park. Underneath the ground there, they have a, a Lemurian solar disk, an ancient Lemurian solar disk. So we're gonna be dropping down into the ground, getting in a great big circle, activating this solar disk and sending the frequencies of these, this solar disk up into a set of geometries that we're gonna to create together. OK, we're going to use the platonic solids, those five geometries nested in inside of each other. When you've got those platonic solids nested, it creates 32 portals, 32 stargates, 32 vortexes. And those 32 vortexes pull into the God seed atom in the middle, OK, into the central component. Now, these portals within the platonic solids, they're connected to nodal points all the way around the planet, certain infrastructures, part of the crystalline architecture that pulls off planet frequency into it. So we're going to be sending frequency from this solar disk up into these geometries and through the portal points into the planet's nodal points. Once they hit that, we're going to send the frequencies from these nodal points to different locations. OK, and we're also going to create a holographic infrastructure around this Hadron Collider. It's gonna be an electromagnetic fence, a mirrored electromagnetic fence, which is gonna send any frequencies and charges that they pulse out from it back into it to disrupt its own technology. So we're gonna go through this process together. And as I said, we're gonna put it up on YouTube afterwards and anyone that wants to go through this can. It's really interesting that NASA have got their little experiment going at the moment which they're flying three rockets into space to test how this is going to affect Mother Earth's atmosphere, the atmospheric pressure around the planet, different BS reasons that they're, they're projecting out to the public. But we know this is all, 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 all to disharmonize and help with uh, what, they're trying, what they're planning on doing. OK, so there's a number of groups around the planet that are running similar exercises tonight and tomorrow. So all of the frequency, all of the codes, all of the grids that we create together, some of them will be the same, some of them will be similar, and they'll all be alchemizing together in the field to create a very powerful infrastructure. The other thing that we're going to do when we create these platonic solids and we fire the frequency up through them and out into the grids around the planet, is we're going to send the frequencies from the platonic solids out into the six dimensional grids around Mother Earth, the new six dimensional grids, which are made from equilateral triangles. They're kind of fluid. There's three layers of them. OK, three, a hundred and eleven sided shapes. So we're going to send the frequency out into the six dimensional grids and then back down into the planet. And then we're going to pulse waves of light out through the 
the planet's architecture up through Mother Earth's surface, up through the skies, through Mother Earth's atmosphere and into space. We're also going to be calling in uh, the galactic sun dragons to be working with us, okay? So it's going to be a beautiful experience. So if you guys are new to star magic, if you've worked with us before, you know how we kind of operate on these little missions. If you don't, uh, if you're one of these human beings that doesn't really see very clearly, just be in your heart, okay? Breathe deeply and just allow yourself to be in the process with us. Just being in your heart and radiating that love is going to be amazing. It's it's such a, a massive role you're pe playing just by holding space. If you guys see clearly, you know, you're going to be able to run the frequencies and the codes as we're running them, you know, on the same um at the same time, along the same kind of um, lines of transmission. So you can play consciously a bigger part in it, even though some of you that think that you may not be playing as big a part, you still will be, just so you know. You know, we're like a big jigsaw puzzle that's coming together and everybody brings a very specific piece of code. And when you bring those pieces of code together, we weave a beautiful puzzle, a beautiful master code, and it's that master code that's gonna help operate this whole space tonight, so. <clears throat> just enjoy the process. I don't know how long it's going to last. We're just going to go through it together. And if anybody wants to share anything at the end, then you can. If you want to ask any questions, you can. And then we'll wrap it up and uh, go and enjoy the rest of our day, knowing that we've put something in incredible in place to stifle, hinder, transmute these efforts of the dark side. What's really important to note as well is the name that they've given to this mission, uh, the, the NASA mission. If you look at what the name means, it's an, uh, an attack on the sun god, okay? So this is all a, an attack on the light, okay? Once that light phases out, three suns moving over the same space, because there's not just one Earth, right? There's three Earths. You know, there's three suns, three Earths, and three ice rings. Like when you fly down, you know, over the poles, over Antarctica. Admiral Byrd, he went down into the planet and he found another whole world. If you fly even deeper, you're going to find a, a whole other world beyond that. There are three worlds, three planets, and there are three suns and three ice rings. Okay. And if you look at that, that solar eclipse that was six years, six months, six weeks, six days, we're flipping that 666 code to a 999 code, okay? If you go back to the Garden of Eden, when the Garden of Eden fell and it became very corrupt, we're switching this. So many things are taking place. This is the end of the venom from the snake poisoning us, poisoning our atmosphere, poisoning our consciousness, okay? We're flipping the switch right now and recalibrating, changing that inverted set of mathematics to an uncorrupted set of mathematics. So I'm just very grateful that you're all here in this space. I'm very grateful that you all chose to be on planet Earth at this time, because it takes an extremely brave soul to come down here onto this planet and do this work, to enter this ascension school, to enter this training ground. They don't just let any soul in. You've got to have trained for billions of years to get in here. So thank you for making the choice, going through your your training and and showing up to 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 go through these missions it's important we've just had israel show up hong kong taiwan amazing more 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 beautiful souls from from around the planet so these grids that we're building are also being anchored through our physical bodies and the crystalline codes that we carry in our own infrastructure so whilst we're doing this multi-dimensionally we're also doing this on a physical physical level I'm plotted up in a hotel right now in Bucharest in Romania. I flew in from, from Cairo literally several hours ago. So we've been in Egypt for the last month, collecting codes, doing our grid work there. Now we're here in uh, in Romania. And then Thursday this week, we're flying to Mexico. So it's interesting, the trail um, that we're, we're, we're kind of following right now to do the work that we need to do. But being here in Bucharest right now is, is very important for what we're going to do this evening. So... Let's do this. All right, beautiful souls. Thank you. You're amazing. So 
wherever you are on planet earth, close your eyes, breathe into your body and just be in this space. Be in this space, breathe into your body. Be here now. And know that you are amazing. We are amazing. We are sovereign, we are whole. We are galactic in nature. Here in this space right now, on a divine mission. Breathe into your body. Deeper and longer and slow. Feel your body. Feel your energy. Feel your heart. Feel your connection to your sisters and your brothers. Your human family. We are one sacred code one formidable force. Feel this, know this, as you breathe in through your nose, all the way down to the pits of your stomach, and back out slow. As you're breathing into your body, your powerful, magical body, you'll become aware of a high frequency, electromagnetic, crystalline, translucent diamond and emerald light. flowing in through the walls, down through the ceiling, up through the floor. This power of high frequency, electromagnetic, crystalline, translucent diamond, and emerald light flows towards your physical body and starts to swirl around the outside of you in a clockwise direction. over your head, underneath your feet, around your chest, around your back, swirling, getting brighter and strong. Swirling around the outside of your physical body like a power of high frequency electromagnetic crystalline translucent diamond and emerald tornado. You start to breathe 
this frequency in. You breathe it in through your nose, up into your mind. It flows into your left brain, into your right brain. It flows around the outside of your skull, down through your head, your face, your neck, your throat. through your shoulders, your chest and back. It flows through your spinal column, middle back, lower back, into your buttocks, through your heart, your lungs, your rib cage. down through every vital organ, through your hips, your groin, it swirls through your thighs and your hamstrings, down through your knees, your calves, past your shins, into your ankles, through your feet, all the way to the tips of your toes. It moves through your shoulders, down your arms, through your elbows, your forearms, your wrists into your hands, fingers, and thumbs. Continue to breathe in this powerful light until the inside of your body is completely full. from the top of your head to the tips of your toes, from the tips of your fingers and thumbs to your crown. Once the inside of your body is completely full in your mind, say thank you and keep Breathing as this light flows through every cell, every atom, every molecule, every fiber of your entire being. Your cells, they dance and smile communicating with each other like one big happy family. Your heart expands and expands and expands, filling up your chest, expanding out past the boundaries of your physical body. and into the space. As the light from your own soul illuminates your environment and the love from your own magical, mystical heart flows and dances freely. 360 degrees in all directions. And as you vibrate, Mother Earth opens her heart. An incredible, 
magnetic platinum light flows up through the rocks and the minerals, up through the surface of the planet, up through your body and into your higher heart. Boom! There's an explosion of energy as Mother Earth connects with you, heart to heart. Magnetic pulses, magnetic waves, magnetic codes flow from her heart into your higher heart and from your higher heart up into your pineal gland. As the master cell in your pineal gland downloads these magnetic celestial motherly codes into every cell in your physical body. As Mother Earth plugs you into her crystalline grid structures on a six and seventh dimensional level. Every cell vibrates faster. You look up in front of you. You become aware of a crystal gold and electric white. Grandmother Sun Dragon staring into your eyes. She spreads her wings and wraps them around your body. She stares into your eyes, deep into your soul. She opens her heart and a beautiful electric white light with crystal gold codes flows out from her heart into yours. It streams up to your crown, down into your earth star from your Earth star back up into your Alpha Transmission Center, from your Alpha straight back down through your body into your Omega, activating your own multi-dimensional Merkaba field. As your heart expands and expands, electromagnetic energy flows up and down your central column. This grandmother sun dragon here to hold space for you. You feel the love, this supersonic ancient connection. You feel lighter and lighter as she whispers into your consciousness, I love you. Tiareatu shaya ku en reana sharieku ushaya uzemu karku ashakwa zeku yara musha kiariano washamate suna aku reanu eshriaku uyamatiari shariata shh your heart expands and expands and expand and your light, your consciousness starts to rise up through your physical body. Up through your shoulders, up through your crown, rising slowly up into the space above. You rise higher and higher. Up through the geometrical building blocks, up through the energy, up through the mathematics, through the frequency, slowly. Leaving your physical body behind. You glance back down at the grandmother dragon. You glance back down at your physical body, realizing you're in two spaces at the same time. Powerful, multi-dimension. As you rise up and up and up, 
feeling lighter and lighter. You glance over to the left hand side. 88 meters away, vibrating in the space is a large crystal gold diamond and ruby red vortex. Rotating clockwise. As it rotates clockwise, it draws your consciousness towards it. Magnetize. You flow through the space towards this vortex, getting closer as it rotates faster, drawing you in quicker. You can feel the energy as you get within 40 meters, 35, 30, 25, 20, 15, 10, five, and whoosh. You enter that vortex, twisting, tumbling and turning, ebbing and flowing like liquid light. You look down, you've got no legs, left and right, you've got no arms, pure consciousness, traveling faster and faster the energy building, your consciousness expanding as you twist, as you tumble, as you spin, as you spiral through this space. You feel so free. Sovereign. No boundaries, no limitations. You feel the love, the love that you are, the high frequency being that you've always been. Here on earth, on divine assignment, as you race, through this space, faster and faster, you see a light at the end of the tunnel, 800 meters, 700 meters, 600, 500, 4, 3, 2, 1, and whoosh! You fly out the other side, you're completely still. You look around, the skies are blue. You look down, you see mountains, red rock mountains. And down below, you see a flat piece of open land in between these red rock mountains, just vibrating in the space. 180 meters from the ground. You look immediately left, immediately right. You see your hands and your arms. You look down, you see your legs and your feet, your light body's back, just vibrating in the space. Up above the Talampea National Park in Argentina on the West Coast, the energy here is amazing. You look around, you become aware of multiple sun dragons, forming a circle around you. There are 111 of them in total, forming a huge circle, here to hold space. As you vibrate, you find yourself descending slowly down 
towards the surface, in between these red rocks. The energy is strong, calm, but strong. As you descend, the dragons descend with you, expanding their circle even larger. And as you descend, you become aware that you're moving backwards. And as you start to move backwards, you look around and see your sisters and brothers in their light body forms, moving out from the central point, forming a larger circle with you. More and more of your star family appearing in this space as we all move back, getting closer and closer to the ground, a hundred meters, 90, 80, 70, 60, 50, 40, 30, 20, 10. You start to descend down through the ground, down into the rock, effortlessly. As you go deeper and the top of your head moves under the rocks, you look around. It seems like the rock is hollow. It's just a different frequency band. As you go deeper and deeper into the rocks, you look down below you. Just over 50 meters is a large gold, platinum, crystal white, and diamond sun disk, an ancient Lemurian sun disk. Light codes all over it, glowing brightly. It's 88 meters in diameter. You see your sisters and brothers all forming this large circle and you hold hands with your sister or brother to your left or right. As we all hold hands in this gigantic circle, descending down towards this Lemurian sun disk, the energy is amazing. You recognize this space. You know that you've been here before. This is nothing new. You're returning to this sacred space. This sun disk has been hidden for millions of years. As you descend, another 30 meters and you'll be around the edge of the sun disk. You look around at your sisters and brothers, all in this together, unity, unified, one love, one heart, one galactic family. Another 15 meters, 12, nine, six, you slow down and come to a stop on the outside of this sun disk in a huge circle, the sun disk in the center. The sun dragons in a larger circle around the outside of us, they spread their wings, creating a powerful field of energy. The dragons open their hearts. Streams of electromagnetic light spiral out from their heart through our circle and into the center of the sun disk. A stream of golden light flows out from the top, 11 meters into the space above. Another stream of light flows 11 meters down into the space below. And then we set an intention to create a holographic structure of Mother Earth in the space above. The stream of frequency coming out from the top of the sun disk. We create a green and blue hologram 
And in the center of that hologram, we create the platonic solids nested inside of each other. Down below the sun disk, we create a hologram of that Hadron Collider in Switzerland. And around the outside of that Hadron Collider, we place an electromagnetic mirrored field. This electromagnetic mirrored field, it starts to glow. And anything that flows out from the collider over the next days will be simply reflected back into itself. And so it is. As you vibrate, your heart opens. A beautiful diamond and blue sapphire light flows out from your heart through the space and into the center of the sun disk. Light codes flow from your heart and the hearts of all of us in this space, connecting with the frequencies of the dragons, switching on this ancient Lemurian sun disk as the codes to activate it flow from our own DNA template, our own Lemurian templates, which are woven into our own architecture. The sun disk starts to spin, it starts to glow, and it starts to release ancient Lemurian coding, which flow out from the top of the sun disk, up in to the platonic solids. The platonic solids, they start to glow and vibrate and they spin inside of each other. and 32 portals that are weaved into this geometrical structure, take the codes and feed them into the God seed atom in the center. The God seed atom absorbs these codes and then grounds them back into the sun disk and at the same time feeds them into 33 portal points around Mother Earth, where there are very specific crystals embedded in the ground, enabling these portal points, these nodal points to function. These 33 portal points pulling in off-planet frequencies are charged and activated, and they send frequency back through Mother Earth's ley lines, through her grid system, and into Mother Earth's heart, which is a Merkaba field in the center of the planet. As that Merkaba field absorbs these frequencies, Mother Earth's heart sends these frequencies back in to the God Seed, in the center of those five platonic solids. All of these codes are absorbed Open your heart wider. As the dragons open their hearts wider, working as a team, one galactic team. As we open our hearts wider, firing those alchemical Lemurian codes into the sun disk, up into earth, up into the platonic solids, waves of energy start to flow from the platonic solids through Mother Earth's hologram and from the golden sun disk through this whole chamber embedded in this rock in Argentina. These waves of energy, they flow out through this inner cave-like structure, out through the red rocks, through Argentina, up through the skies, down through the earth, 360 degrees in all directions. These waves of energy, they flow throughout the planet, 
they flow through the skies up into space, through Mother Earth's atmosphere, connecting to these six dimensional grid structures around the planet as these waves of light, these waves of code flow through Mother Earth's six dimensional grids. The codes are upgraded, amplified, and switch to a higher frequency band. We're now going to set an intention to focus the energy from this sun disk into a point in space-time. It will be the exact point in space-time where the eclipse takes place. We're going to send the frequency right now from the sun disk into this point in space-time to create a reflective shield that will bounce any frequencies off from these portal points that they're trying to create, sending the frequency and the code back to their original pulse points. So everything they send out will be reflected back to them. We're going to replicate this behind the moon. We're going to replicate this in Sirius. We're going to replicate this in the Pleiades. Eight portal points in total. As we create these eight structures, energy flows. from this sun disk up through Mother Earth's atmosphere into space and branches off in eight electromagnetic directions, plugging into these points in space-time, creating these reflective grids as we open our hearts wider. Knowing that love is our greatest weapon, Geometry and mathematics are our mode of transport. As you vibrate in this space, you become aware of your own Merkaba field spinning in the space around you. This 12-pointed star, this multi-dimensional Merkaba field, whizzing five tetrahedrons clockwise, five anti-clockwise. And these 12 points on this star feed 12 electromagnetic streams back into your heart. From your heart into those 12 strand templates. Which activates the 13. From those 12 strand templates into the 12 planetary stargates the 12 galactic and the 12 universal stargates. Again, as you plug into the 12, they become the 13. There's always that 13th sphere housing the 12. As you vibrate, just being, holding immaculate, fierce space, just be here with your heart wide open, spinning inside your Merkaba field, setting up this holographic structure, which is being coded into reality right now. And as you vibrate, you become aware of two ancient Lemurian grandfather and grandmother dragons crystal pink, white, and cobalt blue, with golden eye, a golden tail. They enter the space to the left and right of the sun disk. These ancient Lemurian dragons open their hearts, sending in charges of male and female coding, electrical, 
and magnetic coding. Streaming through the space, through the sun disk and into the sun disk center. The frequency of the sun disk amplifies and a ray of light flows from the center of the sun disk back through the space towards your heart. It gets closer and closer. Three, two, one, and boom. There's an explosion of energy in your heart. Your whole body vibrates as this Lemurian sun disk charges you with plasma, high frequency healing cards, high frequency DNA activation cards, which flow through your spinal column quantumly, through those 33 vertebrae. And then your 33 vertebrae plug back into those platonic solids, into those 33 portal points from the platonic solids into the 33 nodal points around the earth. And the 33 nodal points around the earth send charges of light back through the platonic solids into your spinal column, activating your own extraterrestrial galactic DNA. Just be in this space and let the frequency run. Be in this space, be a beacon of light a pillar of purity. Tiara ku sina shatu karia kwa nushem wali yana matuati shia eka ana ua shariaku shariaku an yariana zuna sheku anu zana wash kiero ukiari atuana shatata as energy flows up and down your central column, your light body vibrating, charging, plugged in. Uyana shariatari. Uku ana yara shirienu zuna. La un eo a sheku ziana shirie. La un eo a rata anku ve shuna eka iriatu. Yariana shirua tkiketete. Shata shu. Utu naku. Feel these frequencies. Racing through your body. As we set these grids up. Stamping them into space time. Reinforcing. Magnetically and electrically. Your whole light body receives an upgrade. Reconnecting to these ancient Lemurian frequencies. As the great grandmother and great grandfather dragons open their hearts wider, streaming that light. That ancient build a race code into the solar disk into the sun disk as energy flows up into mother earth down into the hadron collider reinforcing this infrastructure knowing that we've done this so many times as a family it's a walk in the park we are quantum architects alchemists Gods and goddesses, warriors from the stars. Just be here and feel this. Be here and know this.
you carry this wisdom in every cell in your body. And as you vibrate, you become aware of diamond light flowing down through your crown into your genesis cells, activating that Merkaba field quantumly between your genitals and your anus, right inside your perineum. Top tetrahedron rotates clockwise, the bottom one anti-clockwise. An electrical energy held by the feminine streams up through your central column and into your brain, plugging into your crown, activating that thousand petal ancient lotus flower, which connects your vital organs, your spinal column, to ancient grid points throughout the planet. The grids are locked in. You hold them inside your human body. You hold them ethereally. We are powerful. The great grandmother and great grandfather dragon, they acknowledge you. They salute you with their wings and love pours out from their soul through yours. You feel nurtured, held, respected, inspired by your own co-creation. The dragons start to weave a geometrical template around this whole area. They put up a multi-dimensional Merkaba field and activate it, keeping it invisible. You look to your left, you look to your right, smiling at your sisters and brothers. You look around at the dragons behind you, their hearts bursting with joy. Deep gratitude. You feel it, they feel it. The love is second to none. The dragons thank you. They whisper into your consciousness, we love you. And then you look up above you. You see a large diamond portal, 21 meters above, vibrating, rotating clockwise. As it rotates, you start to ascend slowly up through the space. You place your hands over your heart, thanking the grandmother and grandfather dragon. You look around at your sisters and brothers, deep respect. You look around at the large circle of sun dragons, loving them. As you ascend up towards this portal, you get within 15 meters, 12, nine, six, Three and whoosh, you fly up ever so fast, twisting, tumbling, spinning, and spiraling, ebbing and flowing like liquid light. You look down, you've got no legs, left and right, you've got no arms, flying up through this portal ever so fast. Your consciousness expanding, your heart flowing, love pouring out from you, love pouring into you. You realize that you are a part of the whole. Nothing is disconnected. You are everything and nothing. You are light, you are dark, you are sound, you are a musical instrument. Traversing this portal faster and faster. Spinning through this space. On this never ending ride that we call life. With many twists and turns. A real adventure. 
as you travel faster and faster. You look up above. You see a light at the end of the tunnel, 800 meters above you, 700 meters, 600 meters, 500, 400, 3, 2, 1, and whoosh! You fly out the other side. You're completely still. You look down. Three meters below you, you see your physical body. You see the sun dragon holding space for you, loving. You just take a moment just to be, to observe and feel. And as you vibrate, just being, you start to descend slower. Down towards your physical body. Your crown opens like a thousand petal. Emerald, diamond, and blue sapphire lotus flower with a chromium core. You get closer and closer and you start to descend down through it. Down through your crown, your head, your face, your neck, your throat, down into your cosmic heart. Your crown closes, your light starts to expand into your shoulders, chest, and back. Arms, hands, fingers, thumbs. Legs, ankles, feet and toes. Neck, throat, head, face, left and right brain. You start to become aware of your physical body. The vibration in your bones, the tingle in your cells, the frequency in every muscle. We're going to count from five back to zero. When we get to zero, open your eyes, come back into this space and just be. Take your time, there's no hurry. Five, ti ariana. Four, shirieko una. Three, zana kare kanashakuar. Two, iara kuatamu kiara. One, suya zeku. Zero, shirieko. Whenever you're ready, Open your eyes, come back into this space and just be. Feel your body, feel your energy, feel the space. Just be here now. La un eo a rata an cuve. We are whole, we are sovereign. We are free. Just be here for a moment. Just be in this space. Knowing the good work that you've done, the good work that we've done as a tribe, as a family. We are unshakable, unnameable, unfuck with them. Spiritual gangsters on a human mission, on a galactic mission. Feel this, know this. I love you 
I respect you. Thank you so much for being here. Here in this space today to do this work and here on this planet. Doing what you're doing on a daily basis. Walking around, being the biological computer that you are. Uploading, downloading, sharing frequency and code. We're always working. We're always co-creating. The job never finishes. <laughs> My screen's frozen, so I'm not sure if you guys are putting in messages or not. I can't actually look at the webinar chat at the moment. It's just not letting me. I'm not sure why. So I can't see if you guys have got questions. I know you guys will be sharing because you always do. And I'm sure there are questions, but I can't see any of them. It might come back on in a minute. There was about a thousand of us on this call, guys. So just big, deep respect to all of you. Make sure you stay hydrated these next days. Okay. And I know that some of you will be holding space with this grid structure over the next days. If you know how to do that, you know, I know you'll be doing it. If you don't, it's not a problem. Okay, there'll be parts of your multidimensional self that will be out there in the field, always doing the doing the work anyway. We never really sleep. When we go to sleep, we wake up. It's an ongoing process. And whether you're aware of it or not, it doesn't matter too much. Things are happening. Things are taking place. For those of you that are part of the Star Magic Tribe, I love you. Thank you for being here. If, uh, if you've not been, if you're not a part of the Star Magic Tribe and this is your first kind of adventure with us just thank you for being here thank you for showing up thank you for finding us and for you guys that are watching this on youtube that didn't take part in this live go and do the meditation there's no time and space in the quantum field so going and doing it again is just going to reinforce these grids it's going to reinforce them now and it's going to reinforce them at the time that we actually did this okay because there is no time there is no measurement there is no distance so everything reconfigures itself in the moment. It's the beautiful, beautiful thing about the quantum fields. You can create magic. You can rewrite the code. You can change the code. You can take something down and recreate something just like that very quickly. So make sure you look after yourself over these next days, guys, okay, and weeks. This was a lot of frequency that we were working with. For those of you that are new to this work, you know, these frequencies are going to be healing you at the same time. If you go on a bit of an emotional roller coaster for a few days, a few ups and downs, it's completely normal. Just breathe, stay hydrated, move your body, you know, get your bare, bare feet on the earth. Connect to the stars, connect to the earth's grids. Go to starmagichealing.org check out infinity you can get free access for seven days we've got light language transmissions cosmic yoga hundreds of meditations light codes to activate you mystery school teachings private telegram groups so you can connect with beautiful souls just like you spiritual gangsters on the same mission so go and check it out we've got our level one training coming up in may if you're interested in understanding how we facilitate healing with star magic. It's one of the most, if not the most powerful modality on the planet. And we're running a five day training online in May. So wherever you are on the planet, you can get access. There's a discount with the training too. So go and check it out. I'm still not getting any access to these messages. They're still telling me there's 893 people on the call, but I'm sure some people have dropped off by now. And I'm sure there's bundles of comments and meditations, but I can't see anything. And it doesn't look like it's going to shift anytime soon. So I'm going to love and leave you guys. And, and I'll see you real soon. Peace out.